Hey YouTube, I wanted to make this video about uh, paranormal activity. I've been watching this YouTube channel called Huff Paranormal and it's really intrigued me a little bit more. Um, I've had some paranormal activity happen in my house here and there. Not often, but every once in a while it's happened. In the past 10 years I've lived here, uh, maybe seven, seven years ago, I uh, had a lamp turn on uh, next to my bed at 4 o'clock in the morning. Um, the lamp was not a touch lamp. It was not plugged in. It, it was just, just turned on. Um, that was a little weird. Uh, I think maybe once or twice I've heard like what I thought were noises in the wall and I thought maybe it was my neighbors but there, it's happened before my neighbors at home and I have neighbors in front of me and, and next to me. Um, I'm in a townhouse unit so it's connected. Um, so it, it's always a little weird uh, hearing these things you know and, and every once in a while it just sounds like you know when I've heard them and it's only, I think it's only happened twice but I heard them it sounded like a frequency and someone talking to a frequency. So, um, really got more interested in this, and, and I don't like messing around with this because, you know, things, things do get a little weird. Um, but I did install an app, and I really want to show you, maybe you can see the app, what it's called. Uh, of course, it's too bright now, right? Let me see if I can brighten this down a little bit. I don't know if you can. No, of course it's too bright. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it's too bright. Okay. It's called... Ghost Hunting Tools Detector. Um, so when I first installed it, it's a little skeptical, but let me read it. It's got 13,000 downloads and it has a, a four star rating, which is, uh, I believe it's, wow, four star might be one of the best you can possibly get. I think, no, maybe five, I think is the best you can get on the App Store. But uh, some of the ratings that, you know, we've I've seen, uh, uh, so from somebody, uh, very a a accurate as an avid spiritual adventurous ghosts and anything paranormal has always excited me I'm a very talented and intuitive individual and a practicing medium the sounds you hear I believe are bogus clearly it's a recording so the sounds that you're gonna hear which I will play through my trusty Chewbacca speaker uh, through Bluetooth <laughs> um, clearly it's recordings yet the EMP is extremely on point and so are the majority of the words displayed um, so let me give you a little thing about this is that when I did this, when I first started, the first thing it did, it said my name, um, which, which kind of freaked me out a little bit, but I said, okay, maybe it's just pulling up my profile somehow. It's probably, you know, yeah, I know how these apps work. They pull information from profiles, your Google profile. Maybe that's the first thing it said, said my name to make me believe whatever, right? Um, so yet the extremely important sort of majority of the words displayed. I connected with numerous spirits, including one whom is very close to me. I also pulled out my pendulum to receive secondary advice and it was in line with this app. Phenomenal. So that's pretty good. Uh, this is a great app. It is very accurate. I would have given this app five star rating if it was able to store all the words spoken through the app during that session. That way if you have to walk away for a minute you won't miss anything. We do use this app every every day and on paranormal investigations. Uh, maybe the developer can have an update with the previously stated issue resolved. Uh, the other thing I don't like is that there's a lot of ads on this, so it does pop up with ads. Um, so I, I and I have and I've been using this for maybe for two days now, and words just random words pop up. Sometimes they answer the questions. Uh, sometimes they don't. Uh, sometimes it's just um, just random. You know, okay, we have whatever. You know, just just random word, and I don't even know what it means. Um, so I'll ask and I'll wait a little bit and they'll give me the word uh, and you know sometimes I just think yeah it's using a dictionary it's just pulling a random word out of the dictionary and spitting it out but every once in a while it does answer a question um, what what uh, I think is happening is that it's using different frequencies it just goes through all the frequencies and eventually finds things within the frequency that it's using and uh, using that towards the frequency so you'll hear it it sounds like static um, then when it goes through it, it sounds like a ghost noise when the answer is there. Um, I think maybe we'll go through about five, five to six minutes of this, you know, and see what happens. Uh, we're good here. I'm sent to the spirits as it is without using any device to pick up, up on them. There's a few that reside around our apartment. So I downloaded this and telepathically spoke and within a minute's time started getting responses back on the screen. All the while I could feel its energy around my body. First word it picked up was an assault followed by Bridge and Charlie. The responses were roughly two minutes apart from each other. So keep in mind that, okay, maybe we'll go 10 minutes um, on this. Uh, so it'll be a little bit longer video for this one, maybe for this session. Uh, maybe going forward, it won't be as long. Um, so let's start up.
let's start up. Uh, and one more. This app is amazing. I'm learning a lot about paranormal, and the conversations I had with spirits on here is phenomenal. Before this app, I have seen the apparitions. I have been growled at. I have been touched by unknown sources. Using this app, I was able to talk to spirit about an apparition that I saw walking into my kitchen. I said it looked like my oldest son, but he was out of town at the time, so what I saw could not have been him. The app responded, apparition, and most amazingly, the next word was John. That is my oldest son's name. I never said it. Tell me that wasn't real. So it kind of freaky a little bit, right? Um, I've had names come through that, that are names that I don't recognize at all. So, of course, I ask questions. But let's go ahead. I'm going to start the app. Uh, so you'll see it's, it's an app on here called Ghost Hunting Tools next to my awesome Star Wars app. Let's see if you can see it a little better on there. Ghost Hunting Tools. There. Anyway. Okay, so this is what it looks like when you open it up. Now, like I said, it plays ads, and that's the only thing I don't like. So here you go. There's your ghost hunting tool. And if you can hear it, and already. I'm going to put the Chewbacca speaker right next to here, just so you can pick it up a little bit better. And the first thing I'll tell it is, uh, hello, I come in peace. Would you like to send me a mes message? And it, it's it's going. I mean, it's really going. What message would you like to send me? And every once in a while, you have to ask questions and talk to it again. So again, I'll ask, what message are you trying to send me? And there's one. And it says, Graveyard. So, it doesn't mean anything. I don't have a graveyard near me. Um, might just mean that the person knows that they're dead. By the way, this is the word history that I had before. I'm going to clear it just to get a, just to get a better understanding here. So I'll ask uh, more about this is uh, what do you mean by graveyard? Now in my opinion when it goes up more like it was doing before if it goes red, I, I think it's kind of a mental thing of you know really getting the whole you know feeling that something is around you. Um, maybe there is, maybe there isn't, I don't know. Lights. So, lights. It, it's saying lights. So, why don't... If I turn on the lights, will it make any difference? So we'll turn on the lights a little bit. Um, interesting. I'd be very curious what, what this means by lights. Um, so, by the way, this is 11.30 at night, you know, and now I turn on the lights, and... Okay, the lights are on now. So, what do you mean by lights? Did you want me to turn the lights on, or do you want me to keep the lights off? It's starting to really go up now. You can see it. Yay. So. I don't know what that means. The only thing I can think of is, is the, uh... Okay. The only thing I can think of is I have a, a Yankees uh, championship thing up on my wall. Uh, World, World Series Champs 27. Um, I'm gonna, you know, put it towards there and see, you know, just, just kind of see what happens. Point my, point this app towards there. Okay, so now I'm pointing towards the Yankee thing. Maybe that's what they're looking for. Maybe they're around that area. I, I, maybe they just disappeared. I don't know. There's a vent right there. I don't know. Okay. Um, it stopped. It, it, it just stopped basically now. Um, 
So, I'm going to leave the lights on for now. Just because it makes it feel a little bit better. And now it's coming through again. Branches. This is branches. Unfortunately, what happens with this app is sometimes the word doesn't stay there. So when you have to go to the actual list, it says lights, yank, branches. So it's interesting. Um, again, done. I, I, I don't really know what branches means. It could just mean they're outside. I've been getting a before I was doing this, and I've been getting a lot of stuff outside. Like like they were talking about stuff outside. Um, so let's continue. Um, obviously, whoever that was uh, has left. Um, so let's, let's continue. Um, if you are there, uh, please send me another message. Uh, if you are a new spirit, and there it is. And there is that. Wow. That's just terrible. So, this is the only thing I don't like about that app is that it gives me an advertisement, but you can X out of it and go back to it. So, and I'm not going to pay for it, obviously. So, let's go ahead. Um, okay. So, can you please send me a message? By the way, just so you know, I'm not. I'm not pressing anything, I'm not putting any words in there, um, can you please send me another message, can you s send a message to the people who will be watching this, and let them know what exactly is being, you're trying to tell people, nope, okay, um, okay, so maybe, there we go, there's their message. I am here. Interesting. This is not the first time that someone has told me I am here. Um, okay, so so let me ask you, if you are here, um, who are you? Who are you and what is your name? And by the way, when they said I am here, I actually had like, a, my hair was sticking up on the back of my neck a little bit. So, it, I felt like there was something there. Just don't know. Um, so if you are here, could you please tell us your name? Sometimes it takes a little bit longer for the messages to come through. Okay. Again, if you are here, could you tell us your name, please? I'd like to know. We'd like to know. What do we call you? So, uh, so sometimes they don't answer, they don't want to give their name, I, I, I don't really know. Um, I understand, and that's fine. So, I, and sometimes it just disappears, so that's like get another, a different message. Uh, so yeah, you got the I am here though. Yeah, so, so that was the message they want to send, I am here. Doesn't know what that means, don't know what that means, but it just means I am here. Um, don't know where, ah, I'm actually feeling like there's something behind me already too. Like, I actually, like, my, my hair is on my neck again, I'm standing up, and, yeah, sure enough. Muddy. <laughs> well, we had a lot of snow, and we had a lot of rain in the past week, so yeah, it probably could be muddy outside. Um, interesting. 
Again, it's been talking about the outdoors a lot today. And I don't understand. So it might be just be somewhere out outdoors or something. So would you like to send us another message? Again, by the way, my other hand's here. I'm not pressing anything. Just so everyone realizes that I'm not doing anything with this. So. Okay. So, now you see both my hands. So now, now everyone knows that I'm not doing anything with this. And this is exactly what's happening. So, what other message would you like to send everybody? said maze so just so you can see what it said here's what the export history it said lights yank branches I am here muddy maze looks like they're trying to come through still okay um could you tell us your name could you share with everyone what your name is I think everyone would like to know That's coming through really good. So last again, can you tell everyone what your name is? If you're coming through, can you tell everyone what your name is? Wow, that's a good one. Hopefully I get a name. Paige. So there you go, there's a name. So, and, and what I've noticed is that there's been a lot of female names coming through, um, which is very strange to me. So there's your name, Paige. I don't know any Paige other than Paige in WWE. Um, that was Paige in WWE, but, you know, um, very odd. Um, a lot of names that I don't know have been coming through, so I'll give this maybe a couple more minutes. Okay, hello Paige, nice to meet you. Just realize that I come in peace, and, and if you want to tell anyone anything, now is the time. my hands up so everyone realizes that I'm not doing anything. So Paige, send us one more message, and I'm going to upload it here. Uh, there we go. And Paige is telling us, answer me. Oh, okay. What question would you like? What question do you have for us, Paige? And, and I just want everyone to know I, I'm, I have goosebumps right now. Like legit, legit goosebumps. Paige, feel free to ask me a question and I will answer you. I think she might have disappeared because now everything's gone. Um, I'll let one more message come through in case it is a question. If it's not a question, then you know I will log off of this and I'll upload this. Um, but just so everyone realizes, these are the things that I'm getting uh, in, in my house. Now keep in mind I'm in the townhouse development, so there's probably a lot of things going on around here that I don't know about. Uh, spirits, if they are coming through, uh, they're coming through all around me, I'm sure. I uh, definitely would like to know uh, if this page person is still here, uh, if she has a question, and if not, we will, we will move on. Um, it would seem like, yeah, I did, I, I was getting goosebumps though when she was there, when, when she said answer me. Um, let me see. 
Now I was trying to see if she had a question, but she did not. Now if she does come through again and there is a question, I will answer her. So, nothing's come through. Um, I really do want to give it one more try, just in case. So, if you have a question, again, please ask, and I will answer you. Um, if not, I, I leave you in peace, and I wish peace among you. So, there you have it. Okay, so, just so everyone knows, here are the words that we had. We had lights, yank, branches, I am here, muddy, maze, page, and answer me. So in a span of, oh, uh, it seems like, it seems to be going every minute or so. Uh, then it got to, about, yeah, it's about every minute. It was going about every minute, then it stopped, and we haven't seen anything in about three minutes or so. Alright, so. There it is. So. Okay, so that's it. We're not going to play around anymore. Answer me was the last thing. I don't know what answer me means. Um, I'd like to know, but thank you, uh, everyone, for watching this. Um, whether you choose to believe or not, that's up to you. Uh, you know, obviously, things have happened. I, I've gotten answers. I've gotten questions sometimes on here. <laughs> so, um, I'll probably play around with this app a little bit more. Maybe she doesn't want me to record uh, looking down at it. I don't know. But yeah, I'm going to upload this to YouTube. And obviously, you know, some people believe. Uh, you know, and next time, I think I'll tell you a story about another paranormal uh, thing that I had, maybe through my dreams, that uh, maybe people can understand. Uh, you know, kind of get, kind of give me some advice as to what it was. But yeah, uh, and nothing's happening. Wow, one, two, three, four. It's almost been five minutes and we have nothing. Four or five minutes, we have nothing. So, okay. So there you have it. Uh, yeah, because the last one was the last thing that we had was 11:38:58, and that's 11:43:12:3:4:5:6. We close the five minutes. Okay. So, oh, we have one one coming through just in case. The last one, in case this is a question. So just everyone knows. Greg. So there's another person coming through, Greg, and I don't know who Greg is. So Paige is not here anymore. Um. Greg, would you like to send a message to anybody? So everyone sees. Just so everyone re realizes. Greg, you will be on YouTube. Would you like to send a message to everyone? So Greg's disappeared too. Okay, and that's fine. And, and we're going to leave it at that. So yeah, uh, thank you for watching. Um, I don't know it's so, Of course. As soon as I say thank you for watching, I go. Um, let me give it two more minutes here. With Greg. I only know one Greg. I doubt it's the Greg that I know. There you have it. Of course, now it's new. Every time I say there you have it, it's coming to back. So, but I think there you have it. If anything else comes through, uh, I will share. Um, some of the next sessions will be a little bit shorter. This was just an introductory video, I think. 25 minute introductory video. So, yeah. Feel free to comment anything, uh, any experiences you had. Whether you had experiences with this app, whether you have experiences in personal life. Uh, whether you believe, whether you don't believe. Um, you know, that's really up to you. Uh, so, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video.